We can go for a full Blasma build. Like, I'll take every single Blasma weapon. We'll bounce all over the enemies. And take it as far as possible. That's actually really nice. Nice. Perfect. Perfect start. Oh, I need gold. Is that gold? Yeah, that's gold. Nice. Wait, I almost have the quest finished. That means I have enough for three rerolls. I can easily get the Breach Cutter with that. Oh, that's huge in the beginning. Okay, let's try to avoid getting bonus experience though, because I would really like to finish the quest. Can you not do that, please? Ouch, this will hurt. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Breach Cutter. Nice. I just need some more stuff that actually, like, focuses down enemies. I can't take that much random stuff. Uh, sure, let's focus on you. Oh, man. I always think I can move away faster here, but I can't. Let's upgrade you and let's get shocking on you. I'll actually go for damage and reload speed. Let's make it giga fast at the end. How do you make it look so easy? I like how you say that after I just died. <laughs> I can't win a single Hazard 5 challenge. Um, I, honestly, I think it just has to do with how much you're used to the game. It's not like that I win every single run, but usually you... Like, the main thing you need to learn is just get lucky. See? Just get lucky. It's that simple. You, you don't need skill, just get lucky. Nah, but for real, you know what weapons are good and bad and when and what to take. But I've also had games where I lost Hazard 5 just because the game didn't provide me the weapons that I wanted. Now, to be fair, if I play on stream, if I play just for fun, it's a whole different story than if I would try hard. Because here I'll make memes, I'll make, you know, fun things. Which also create the most fun experiences, but I would say my win rate goes down to like maybe 50%. If I would always play Hazard 5, I would say it's like 95%. Like, if you're serious and you know the character that you're playing and you don't just play a random character, then it's very hard to lose. Now, if there was a challenge to play a random character, then I would have a lot more problems. Then I would have a lot more problems because I don't know some of the other characters, how they work and stuff, you know? So, yeah. And I think some characters are also just so bad they can't really win. I think one of the best things you can probably do in this game... That's actually a good plasma weapon. Sure. One of the best things you can do in this game is just to delay the boss kill to get a more experience. Um, but then, like, don't go around and find Nitro stuff, but just try to get kills. That's, like, one of the best things. Also, using the explosion guys at the right moment is really good. Taking damage to make sure that you can do certain things. Like, not taking damage is good. But sacrificing HP, if it highly benefits you in the long run, is worth it. Like, to get bonus XP. Okay, the, these bumpers are really annoying, I'll be honest. I take a lot of damage from them where I don't need it. But yeah, overall, it's very worth it to... Like, for example, sacrifice HP to get through uh, some enemies. Like, let's say 100 HP. And you get all of the experience, and otherwise you wouldn't have gotten it. Um, I'll go for that. Yeah, okay, I don't like that. Let's go for you. The only issue here is, I think the, the Breach Cutter is actually a horrible weapon, and I have to focus on it. Which doesn't really help me to easily do this. Because I put a lot of level ups into it. Actually, I don't like any of the Plasma weapons, I'll be honest. The only weapon that I like with Plasma is this one. And the turret is also fine with Plasma. But I like it with Electrical way more. And as a fourth slot, you usually want to have like an Electrical or an Acid in there. Whatever you don't have. Because it debuffs the enemies. If you have them, you can also go for Cryo. If you're scared... Hey, I'll take that. If you're scared, you can also go for Cryo. Like, both of these cases, it's really good. To just make sure that the enemies are dealt with. Adds one more beam, nice. Can I explode you? Okay, you just randomly exploded, that's good. Yeah. Let's mix it up a bit. Level 25 shouldn't be all too hard. Uh, let's roll. Sure. Level 20... Wow, level 25 is insane. <laughs> oh, let's just do it again. Let's just do it. Full Blasma build. Let's go. Or you could just go bonkers with AoE and never fear anything, right? That's also true. AoE is insanely good in this game. Like, unironically, it's insanely good. Uh, oh, these both are really good. 
Weapon range on Blasma is insane. I think I'll actually take that. Then we'll take you. Oh. Um, I'll take the armor here. Armor is also like some, a little bit underestimated in this game, but at the same time overestimated. It's it's a bit of a weird story. So it's good to have armor if you use it, but if you don't use it and you only want it to not get one shot by the final boss, for example, then it's bad. Like you can use armor when you have HP around to sacrifice HP to get like better paths through the enemies to collect experience. But if you only take it to not die, then all you do is you make yourself weaker compared to taking a damage upgrade. Like, th this is how I view armor. So when I have more armor, I know I can, for example, like, dig my way through. And if there would be a lot of... Alter Schwede. That's nice. Yeah, if there would be a lot of enemies here, I can just take that damage instead of going, like, all the way around to make sure I don't get hit. The only downside of going for defensive things is they are boring. <laughs> it's like... But seriously. I, I don't like that. You know? I'd rather like to have a meme run where I go full bonkers and then end up dying than going full defensive and winning. But this is all up to the, the mindset of the player that's playing. Like if someone says I have the main fun winning, hey, win. Win every single game, do it. It's a single player game, it's all about your own fun. Hey, even in multiplayers, you know, if you want to try hard and other people don't want to try hard, just try hard. Doesn't matter. It's your own game. Now, if you get upset for them for not tryharding and it's like a casual lobby or like a normal lobby, that's a different story. You shouldn't get upset about that. Uh, a good example is League of Legends. The mode I played the most there is Aaron, but I liked, like, I, I like to play for wins, but I don't like to try hard, you know? I will still, like, if I can end the game, I'll end the game. If, if the enemy does something stupid, the enemy gets killed. Um, but if I hit a snowball, I'll go in. However, if someone, like, intentionally trolls others, I'm not all too fond about that, because I don't like that. So, for me, it's like, I try a lot there, but it's a fun mode. But if others have, like, just fun and literally run it down, because it is a fun mode, I don't care. Do it. Do it and have your fun. Um, yeah, I'll max it out. I should, I should have actually maxed it out way earlier. Talking about knowing your weapons, the first one is Giga Broken. You don't have fire rate, right? Yeah. You have fire rate. You don't have fire rate. Now, this is a, something that can easily kill me. So, I'm not the biggest fan of taking that. Let's take the turret plasma. Nice. That makes the turret so much better. The optimal case would be now that we get mines to walls. I should really look for crit damage. I'll actually take the HP here. Like, 50 HP is a lot. If you get a purple HP, sounds good. If you get a red HP, also sounds incredibly good. Now, uh, maybe I should have upgraded this one. Now, we have a lot of Nitra. I can use that to buy level ups, yeah. We're good. If I have 50 armor, does it remove 50% damage? I have no idea how the calculation works. But I, I wouldn't assume so. I would assume it's like a... Um, oh, what was the word? Like, where the more you get, the less it removes, but technically speaking, it still does the same. So, if you, like, for example, pure example, okay, don't take this number seriously. If you get 100 armor, and it can reduce the damage by half. Now, if you get another 100 armor, it would again half the damage. Like, if you get double the armor, it halves the damage again. But you still take 25% of the damage, right? First, it goes down to 50%, then you double your armor. Then it goes down by half again, but because you only took 50%, now you take 25%. Now you double it again and have a total of 400 armor, it goes down to 12.5%. So even though it looks like it gets more and more expensive to reduce the damage, the total damage is still reduced equally. Oh my mama god. Yeah. But obviously the investment becomes way uh, investment into that to upgrade it becomes way 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 higher. I actually want to roll for the upgrade here. Nah, yeah, that's also good. Now I'm not sure if I like the the turret as a main damage dealer. Oh wow! <laughs> we have seven beams now, right? Did I finish all of the quests so far, by the way? Oh, this is the second stage. Yeah, I did. Nice. 
Oh, that's huge. That's also okay. Um, plasma shocking enemies. Sounds good. Sure. I will not go for the turret. I will look for... Beautiful. That's amazing. All of this is so amazing. Oh my god. Let's go. Hey, a-hole. Thank you for the gifted membership. Thank you. Much appreciated. And also Zogt actually has it. That's a recognized name. Have you got to try all the overclocks? I have tried out most of the overclocks. There are just some weapons I don't want to play. Which I should probably test to just see if they are good. But the thing is, I know the weapons that are good early on. And those are the most important ones. And usually I also take them to 18. So, I don't need more. Jesus Christ, what is going on back there? Which one of these guys is going so crazy? Uh, let's roll. I am the turret is fine. I guess those are the turrets, yeah. Do they have my back? For example, the turrets are very interesting. If you play on lower hazard levels, the turrets are an insta-win. You, all you do is you focus to take them to level 18. You either go for electrical or for plasma. This is kind of important as a first upgrade. But the moment you hit level 18 with them, they destroy anything. Now, Hazard 5 is different. They honestly don't tickle the enemies all too much. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> I'll focus on you. Actually, I should take you to 18. But you'll hear this a lot that I'll say, Oh man, I should focus you, but then the quest is like, No, 25, just have it out of your brain. You know? You will see that a lot with me. Oh. Nah, who needs armor? Who needs armor? This is better than YouTube. Do you enjoy Twitch more? Well, I guess if you're used to it, that makes sense, yeah. I personally think YouTube is better. The funny thing is, just to stream on Twitch, I had to decrease the bitrate on YouTube. Because Twitch didn't allow it. Twitch has a limit on 6 megabits. Oh my god, the double squish. I actually want to use my gold, so I'll take this one. The driver's manual is nice. I like it. Like, it's neither broken, nor bad. It's just decent. That is the kind of stuff that I like. I hope they add more like that to the game. Alter Schwede? What did you say? Uh, Alter Schwede is just something that like Germans sometimes say. Also not everyone. I think in the South it's more common to say that. I don't even know why. Like, we don't really associate this with a Swedish person. We just say it. <laughs> okay, the final boss is here. Did I get the drill? Yeah, we got the, the manual there. The book. How about I don't get hit anymore? Okay. Now I would really like to have a magnet. Oh my god. Um, let's explode these, let's explode you. Man, it's so annoying when you want to explode them and then they die, so they explode, but in your face. Mm, that's a really bad spot for you to be in. Turret? Yeah, I would like to take the turret to 12. Maybe that it follows me around. Worst case, I will... Ch oh my god, I'm giga slow. Oh wow, hurry. Oh no. I think it's actually faster to mine through this than it is to walk around because the, the rocks are so squishy. That's healing for free. There's a magnet. Oh yeah, but that's... Yeah. What the hell is going on there? Twitch is better because Dex reads it more often. No, that's not true. I would say like 90% of the comments that I read are from YouTube. Like it's not even close. Um, and funny enough, like on Twitch, I just miss it. Perfect. We got the quest... Finished? Uh, did I do the wrong weapon? Yeah, what else? That's a good question. Did I do the wrong... <laughs> did I do the wrong one? I should have taken the destroying the... Nah, following around is better. But destroying is more fun. Is it now finished? Uh, what is going on here? Yeah, okay, we finished it. Nice. There are six of those shroom caps here. Oh my god. Look at the breach cutter breaching. I want to have the one when you stand still, you increase your reload speed. What is just going on with the breach cutter here? <laughs> oh, that's a beauty. Like, especially in here. Nice, we got the quest finished. That is the final one, right? I did all of them. Please don't tell me I forgot one. Nope. Nice, let's go. 
Right now we now. just have to win. So to win, I would really like to max out the turret. I should have really uh, went with the destroys walls. That would have been so good to cut through the walls and help me out. Okay, more breach cutter reload speed. Ah, let's go for the turrets. The reload speed would be the meme path to take right now. But Hazard 4 is not a giga choke. It's also not giga giga serious, but it's also not like you can just do whatever. Didn't I have HP? I thought I had HP here. Didn't I mine one at almost full HP, so there should be two more things. I guess not. Weapon range. I don't even know what that means on this one. Like, that doesn't make any sense, unless it's travel distance, maybe? With full fire rate. Um, fire rate doesn't exist on it. You mean probably reload speed, right? I, I don't, also don't think that lifetime exists for it. Maybe. Oh my god, it's getting so laggy. This will be bad, this explosion. Actually, you know what? That explosion just helped me. There's the drill. Uh, let's go for more turret. We'll definitely focus more on the breach cutter a bit. Oh, we got a magnet. Um, okay, these guys will explode. Let's step away. Okay, I'll be honest, it's a little bit hard to see for me. Um, sure. A small chance to find Nitra is not bad. It's also kind of useless. Now I wish I had the... Why Why do you not mind that? Now I wish I had the upgrade that the turrets mine the walls. That could have been a lot of... Okay, listen. <laughs> this is a little bit insane. It's, it's horrible to kill a singular boss, but like for the masses, this is ridiculous. Like, straight up ridiculous. Still not sure what weapon range does. Like, look at how poorly this performs against the boss. I have to take the turret to 18. Yeah. Oh, I need Nitra. Oh no. Where's my Nitra? Okay, I have to hide in the walls that the, the bouncers don't kill the boss. Yeah, he's dead. Oh man, you had to be down there. There's like nothing to mine. Okay, epic. I'll take the crit. crit. I have to hope for a plus 3 on the turret. Just magically appearing. Range is travel distance. Well, travel distance doesn't really exist as a stat with this. So it, it would be like duration, right? Hey, I breathe. Thank you for subscribing, man. Thank you. Very much appreciated. Lifetime on beams. I mean, I guess let's do that. Uh, I want to have the turret. And damage doesn't matter all too much. This would have been insane, but yeah, I can't. Okay, reload speed on the turret is good. Reload speed on everything still means it fires faster. Okay, sure. Let's go. What is your reload speed right now? Oh my god, it's so fast now. Okay, I'll take the HP. That's full HP. Nice. The turrets need two more level ups. Just two more level ups. We got this. Once we have that, we are happy. Gold is good for rolling. And I think then I'll destroy the balls that, like, the boss doesn't, like, is not alive while the balls are alive. The final stage will be the hardest. I wonder what quests they have. Jesus. Okay, that was a nuke. To be fair, they are quite weak. Yeah, okay, but there's lifetime and there's range, you know. This is the confusing part to me. It almost looks like to me range might be how fast they travel. And lifetime is their duration. Because otherwise the word lifetime wouldn't fit in there at all. Do I have enough gold for a couple of rerolls? Yeah, I have. Okay, turret, very good. I just need one level up in that. The upgrade on the turret is just way too good. I can't, like, take something else over that. But after that, we can just focus on the breach cutter. Just imagine every single level up we've gotten this game, we would have put into the breach cutter. We'll ignore the fact that we we'll, would have died. But this could have been level 50 easily. Level 60. This is a death chamber. Oh my god. A anything that walks in here just dies. Oh, well, there's a boss. Okay, so this would be the right decision. This would be the meme decision. Sure. Why not? 
<laughs> I'll roll for the turret. Reload speed of 0 0.8 seconds, fire rate of 26. Oh, I lost it. Yeah, it's fine. Do we need anything? I don't think we need anything, right? I'll just stay here. The, the big ball is up there, so he'll come down and he'll destroy everything here. That means what I want to do is... I want to be against this wall. And I want to widen this a bit. And he'll jump down, he'll destroy the stuff here. Then I walk up to here, so let's prepare that. Then I walk up to here. There's another solid wall that will prevent him from doing stuff. And then I need to... What do I do then? I think I will escape to here. No, I will, I will escape to here. Okay, good. Okay. The plan is set. Now we wait. Now we wait. Actually, I get the experience. We can still use the gold to reroll. Yeah, I want you, but better. Okay, I don't have gold left. I should have just taken the reroll. Okay, the boss is about to spawn. Let's stack up. Let's go. Pop, 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 pop. I don't like how they are leaving to the left here. That's not according to plan. Okay, he's coming. I really hope that would be able to stand still a bit more. Easy. Not even close. Ah, <laughs> oh, that was good. Let's take this up again in this tight spot here. Isn't it amazing? Oh, beautiful. So beautiful. Imagine now we would have discovered a bug that it doesn't always take you in. That was honestly breach cutter, you know. Not bad. Not bad. Really not bad. 